opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. d5 establishes a presence in the center, controls the e4 square, and opens up the light squared bishop. The queen's gambit offers up a wing pawn to attack the center and distract black from the e4 square. In the Slav defense, c6 supports the d5 pawn. And c3 attacks the d5 square and starts the fight for the e4 square. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. This is an equal trade. Takes back. Bf4 develops the bishop to an active diagonal where it controls the center. And c6 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the d4 pawn and controls the e5 square. e3 supports the bishop on f4 and the d4 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. a6 controls the b5 square, stopping any bb5 ideas from white. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This activates a piece and simultaneously wins time by attacking an opposing queen. This blocks the attack on a queen that could have been captured. This prepares the bishop for development. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This offers an equal trade of pieces. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This moves the bishop to safety. It is the last book move. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This overlooks a better way to connect rooks. It is an inaccuracy. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. It is best. This moves the pawn to safety. It is excellent. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This leads to losing a pawn. It is a blunder. This wins a pawn. This is the only good move. This took advantage of a mistake and black now has a winning advantage. It is a great move. This misses a better way to move a queen to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. This forces doubled pawns in front of the opponent's king, decreasing its safety and harming the pawn structure. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This is the strongest option. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is good. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a knight. This permits the opponent to take an open file with a rook. It is a mistake. This misses an opportunity to take an open file with a rook. This allows the opponent to take an open file with a rook. It is a mistake. This ignores an opportunity to take an open file with a rook. This permits the opponent to take an open file with a rook. It is a miss. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is best. This defends the attacked knight. This is the only good move. It is a great move. The game was close to balanced, but now white is worse. It is a mistake. There was only one good move in that position. It is a miss. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and white is worse.
It is best. Very precise. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This threatens to fork pieces. It is good. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This prevents the opponent from being able to create a passed pawn. It is good. There was only one good move there. This overlooks a better way to evade the check from the opposing knight. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is good. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses a better way to move a knight to safety. It is a mistake. This misses a better way to evade the check from the opposing knight. It is an inaccuracy. This leaves a pawn without defenders. It is a blunder. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This misses an opportunity to capture a free pawn. It is a miss. This misses an opportunity to move a piece to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the attacked pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. This move puts the rook on a safer square. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. This breaks a pin, enabling a pawn to provide needed defense. It is excellent. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. It is a mistake. This stops the opponent from being able to take an outpost with a knight. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The game is still close to equal, but black lost their advantage. It is a mistake. Wild a chaotic game where both players had many chances to win. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Black found some nice moves in the middle game. The players battled pretty evently in the end game.